gonna we're gonna refuse to use it. That's what we'll do this time. All right then, once more. The only path open to you now is through this book. Take it. There we go. Now you're properly aiming it. You see, I have changed. There was a time when I might have let you live. I made that mistake with Atrus once. It's a pity you decided not to give me a second chance. Well, there's still time. I said task manager, but really, um, we only need to, you know, press to the desktop and just close the window. <laughs> of course. But we get to see this again. But I you know, haven't shown again. I, on the other hand, have watched this more times. Does the game end too quickly? Or does it not end too quickly because, like me, that's just like purposely playing all these extra endings? I think. I don't know. Maybe it feels like it ends too quickly because I just, you know, know how to play the game already. And so I completed too quickly. I don't know. Oh, right, we do see him climbing up. Then, once more. The only path open to you now is through this book. I can give you a chance to just freeze you at the... Fortunately, I'm not, he's not able to see me. I think it's different from... Wait. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> I was thinking for a moment he was going to... That felt different, I think, than the uh, original version. I don't remember them showing that much. Is the book on the ground? Where's the book? Is it in my inventory? It's in my inventory. Oh, 
Oh, we get another bad ending. We we are we're gonna get another bad ending. Here we go. Right here. Actually, I could um. Wait, what happens if I go back to Tay? Oh wait, is it not gonna let me? That would be the best way to end it though. Like, go to Tay and then use it. So we release him in Tay. <laughs> it's like the worst possible ending. Um, okay, excuse me for a second. It is a little funny that I like asked to be excused because almost no time passes in the recording. <laughs> Uh, you know, because I stop it. I don't just leave it. Sometimes I leave it. Did I ever just leave it? I don't remember. But anyway, um... Wait a minute. Oh, I can. I can't go back. I just need to, like, bring down the cage. Let's listen to this music. I already know it's music, yes. Oh. Oh! <gasps> Wait. What? That's... That was a little weird. to not work that way. Wait, what? I'm having trouble with this for some reason. Oh, there we go. Ah. Come on. what 233 looked like, so... Oh gosh, it's so hard to read. Okay, so anyway, that is a 9 and what looks to be... It's on the side is yeah I had that mixed up okay so it's a nine and a seven so nine times 25 is you know we have 200 plus 25 so it's 225 plus seven that's only 232. Interesting. 
interesting. I wonder... I wonder what this was, you know? Or it will be, because, you know, he made 233. If we currently have... to not be able to walk out here. Wow. Nice. I, at least I don't remember being able to come out here. I don't think it's explained in the game itself. Oh. What? scribbled this out and he's trying to understand what what the deal is. The point being made that it's only a matter of time before he figures it out. Oh cool. I might be getting a little burnt. You should probably take it off. Well I don't know. Maybe it's just really hot on the outside but that's cool. this is it a center or is it something else I don't know yeah no this definitely wasn't in the that's weird you've cut out two sets of stairs I don't know what this is for wait what the heck you've why you have your minions cut you as an altar with their or a throne? What the heck, man? What? That's it? Is this what he's been busy doing? Just like sitting here? Oh, wait. No. Just sitting here, like this whole time. He's just like sitting here, like some hillbilly. Just like, ah, nice view. What I was going to say is that, um, yeah, it's not explained in the game itself, but um, the lore behind this is that um, sea level used to be here. Um, and I think at the time when the sea level was here, it, the ocean was very acidic and it eroded quite quickly. Um, sea level has dropped and I believe it also is no longer as acidic as it used to be. So the erosion is significantly slowed down. Yeah. All right. Well, that's cool. That was cool. I actually didn't expect to be able to come out here. So. Oh hey, wait a minute. This is like is this like the first door that actually opens properly? Is this a locking system down there? Like right here is that that star opening? Or no. Okay, so wait, that was wait, so this is a book for 233 took the 233 descriptive book with you if it's in its own age. Uh, I don't know what these say. I'm, I think I'm going to screenshot that, though. Yeah. Like it's. Uh, we can still see it clearly, but it doesn't have enough power, not enough juice to link to. 
You know, all this could be fixed if you just knew how to write proper books, my friend. Oh, this bed looks different. No more hand leather texture. a little step to get onto your bed. Get that old. I mean, you can climb a ladder. I'm sure you can just like it's it's waist high at most. Anyway. Ah. Uh, you know what? Um I'm not in the mood to read. Um, I think I'm going to finish this tomorrow. That'll be the last of it. <laughs> it's interesting to have control over. You know. Whereas like in the old version, you know, you click, plays its animation and then it stops or is this like you know different kind of experience oh I thought that was a trying at first oh yes I see wait this is different oh it's a combination Paranoid, you don't want anyone reading your messages. Or rather, saved. Is it just me or does it have like a salt or something inside of it? It's just like burned from use. I don't know. Nah, I am. That's your clothes. Yeah, I, I'm actually going to pause here. That's right. Okay, I take it back. The, the game no longer feels like it ends too quickly because I forgot that we still have this stuff to check out. Wait, what's that last word? Not that word, but this word. Love that... What? Again, my husband and my salvation, a delight. Wait. Wait a minute. Hold on. I thought that's a delight, but actually, a dedicate. I dedicate wait, myself to the love that. Rescues me. That is so sappy. But okay. Yeah, but you can notice um, just by listening uh, that that is 12 Edo music and is not, um, you know. The Dunny, the Dunny have 12 Edo music. There's nothing wrong with it. I think in the old game, this was one of the few things that was randomized. Let me listen to that again. I think I think I am still gonna stop. I was thinking for a second that I might just finish everything, but no, we'll stop here because um, there's just still too much to do, even if it's not much.
busy day today. Oh, you know what? That was my... I need to get a new mouse. That was actually the mouse itself that was getting stuck. Um, yeah, so I'm a little tired. I start this latest journal with astounding news. Catherine has returned to the fifth age, and though it sets my teeth on edge to say it, she has also vanished as quickly as she appeared, stolen from me by the rebels. As my guards, guard tells it, she linked into the Fisher Plateau cage, just as I had surmised, when suddenly he was set upon by a band of rebels who darted him and spirited her away. I expect the truth of the matter was that he was so dumbfounded at actually witnessing someone link in after all this time that he presented an easy target for whichever rebel happened to be nearby. The damnable luck of it. He did get a good enough look at her, though, to verify that it was indeed Catherine. He also claims that he inspected all of the belongings her belongings and found no linking book on her person, a fact that I find hard to believe, but if true makes the question of why she's returned here all the more puzzling. While I am sick with frustration at having lost the only uh, query that Cage has even ever caught, I'm also filled with hope, as she may yet provide me with a way back to Dunny. It is true that I have managed, despite overwhelming odds, to break free of the confines of the Fifth Age and resume my mission to save my culture from extinction. But I fear that unless I am able to regain access to the vast resources that lie in the city's ruins, the task of resourcing that great civilization, reconnect. Whoa. Resurrecting that great civilization will be impossible. If Catherine did bring a linking book with her, then I am halfway there. If not, then she is trapped in the Fifth Age, and I can only assume that my emotionally crippled son will soon be along to rescue her. Either way, it is crucial to my plans that I find her soon. Her presence here now forces me to take the rebels more seriously. I should never have permitted them to survive this long. Once again, the great work has demonstrated its usefulness to me. The villagers have been difficult to manage in the wake of Catherine's arrival, and their fear of this mythic beast has been all that has kept them in line. Had I known how truly useful these prodigious creatures would prove to be, I would have captured more of them. While the local population was still plentiful, Although, to be sure, if these disturbances continue, my current pets will be in no danger of per perishing for lack of nourishment. The search for Catherine continues. I deeply regret my mistake of having ever taught these primitive people anything at all about the books. It seems that with each passing day, I more sorely realized the extent to which they were not ready for that knowledge, not even in the simplified manner in which I presented it to them. Their minds adapted only to the exceptionally menial tasks of village life were incapable of comprehending the art in all its complexity and were thus unable to gleam any of the underlying principles that are, ironically, so elegantly simple. It is obvious that so much of the discord that exists between us stems from their failure to grasp the meaning of the information I gave them. If they'd been able to gain even the smallest glimpse of the glorious future I had planned to for them, this conflict would not exist. The minds of the children, however, are much more malleable. With the proper tutelage, they have developed a more... What the heck? I really need a new mouse. Ooh. Appropriate posture toward the culture that has given them their lives. At times, they take it to almost as if they take to it almost as if they had a bit of Dunny blood in them. 
Given the natives' inborn limitations, however, I am quite careful that none gain a level of understanding that would permit them to sin against their future the way that Catherine did. How foolish I was to think that she could wield such knowledge responsibly when it was quite clear that my own son could not. Atris, still he remains one of the greatest disappointments of my life. I should have never let him with my mother. By the time I'd returned for him, he had already been poisoned as to all thoughts of aiding me in my noble mission. Perhaps that was only the only way she could soften... Okay. This mouse is, needs a little help. I used to have a better... Okay. weigh this down and it's not going to interact with the the problem is actually with the USB um, cable <laughs> all right all right perhaps that was the only way she could soften the fact that she had been responsible for the collapse of the entire civilization so much destruction, so many great lives lost. The guilt must have been unbearable. She did seem to love my father and our world, but ultimately she was an outsider whose ignorance of the Dunny became the catalyst for their demise. If I am able to rebuild our culture and in the process reconnect in the process connect such weaknesses, then perhaps what she did was ultimately necessary in order that a new, stronger era of prosperity might someday come to pass. I've been increasingly beset by images from the past. These last few weeks, as I stood in the schoolroom today, I was reminded of my own childhood. These years I spent, the years I spent in the Bookmakers Guild, father's imminent pride at each of my small accomplishments there. He was an important man in the Dunny world but I cannot bear to think of him for long. It is too much. I was too young to see such things. I have her. Last, late last night, I received word that Catherine had been apprehended while attempting to persuade some of the villagers to join her. I lost a few men in the process, but I would have gladly paid a hundred times that number for such a prize. She's been imprisoned in my old office, where I've been attempting to gain some insight as to the reason for her return. I've had to fight the all but constant impulse to put her on the gallus, gallows as she has adopted the most infuriating stance of only answering my questions. when she answers them at all in the native in her native tongue even so she is a poor liar i am now certain that her return to riven was unintentional and that she brought no linking book with her as far as her willingness to share with me the location of the moiety we shall see without their leader however they are once again powerless against me if catherine's coming here was indeed an accident, then Atris is bound to come for her. That is a given. The question I must now consider is, how will he attempt it? Is it? It is likely that his hesitation is due, at least in part, to this dilemma. One way or another, though, he'll have to bring a linking book to get back where there is no other way. It's late and I cannot sleep. I lost so much in my life, my people, my father, my son, and you, my wife, Keta. You are the only true kindness I have ever known. Watching you flicker there in the imager, I sometimes wonder if you were real. 
If I could restore your life with my pen, I would do so in an instant, and leave the rest of the world to th their own wretched fate. Damn these savages. I would be well advised to leave them all in the fifth age, and begin again with a clean sheet of paper. A stranger has arrived in Riven, on Riven with a linking book to Dunny. And once again, my useless minion was overtaken by the revels. From what little I could decipher of his muddled explanation, it apparently occurred some time this morning. The cage mechanism has been damaged, but that is no matter. Everything I need is here, now. Atris is certainly behind this, but why would he send someone else in his stead with, and with a linking book, no less? Surely he would have guessed that I would be waiting for him. Such recklessness is unlike him. Could it be that he's had a change of heart toward me? That after all these years, he has finally decided to let his poor old father go? Ha, huh, I know all too well where his loyalties lie. He is only after one thing. Perhaps this stranger should find her. For now, I need only to wait and observe. I'm beginning to think it was a mistake to allow the stranger to roam freely about the islands in their ignorant pr um, probing. They attempted to power the damaged drawbridge from Temple Island, and the entire bridge collapsed. A trivial loss at this point, but it irks me all the same. Had I not yet managed to free myself from that crumbling age, it would have happened, hampered my progress severely. But again, it is no matter now. The day will soon come when I will be done with Riven forever. Disconcerting news. Last night, a group of maintainers, maintainers happened upon a lone rebel scout and were able to engage him long enough to learn of a most implausible device. A crystal window supposedly capable of amending my linking books, much the way that my own remarkable system does, but with one slight advantage. It is, a, is small and weighs only a few pounds, making it entirely portable. If this outlandish claim is true, then the artifact in question must be something that Catherine fabricated prior to her capture, no doubt from an explicit Dunny schematic she brought with her. If only I had had, had success to such a document all these years. The portent of this revelation is deeply troubling. Some years ago, the rebels managed to ab absent with a dysfunctional linking book I intended to destroy. The book was never recovered, but once they had sufficiently atoned for this sacrilege, I graciously decided to let the matter slide, thinking that in their inept hands it could do, no, do me no harm. But if Catherine has indeed empowered them with such a device, the rebels may well have linked to another age. It also means that 200, wait, hold on. Which one is this? Yeah, 233 is no longer safe. This cannot stand. The stranger is the key to all of this. Tracking their movements has given me a good idea of where this rebel linking book and the crystal may be hidden. But before I can deal with that, I must secure the linking book back to Dunny. Everything hinges upon that. If I can regain access to my arsenal of resources there, I will happily leave the whole of Riven to its own dismal future. Image codes. Keta 5. I'll write this down. 5. Oh boy. Pen is not working. Father uh, 2 3. Anna 2 3 5. Um, so that's cool. Cause there's, there's going to be more already. There's some new stuff. Obviously we keep finding new things. Uh, speaking of, um, 233 being safe. Uh, I w 
I, I know I commented about how strange the current version of this is with how we get to 233 and how it didn't seem very secure at all where we're just leaving it behind but I'm pretty sure that in reality um, it's locked behind a code and it would be um, it would be getting reset each time it's used it's just that that would be annoying for gameplay and so it just stays open but I do imagine that um, after being used, um, you know, that probably would only stay on for a short bit of time. At least that's what I want to believe. But but I do think that's kind of the intention. I don't think that it's like literally supposed to just be sitting there after being used. It's I, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to reset and then, you know, unless you know the combinations, you wouldn't be able to get to it. All right, so. Let's see, I'm not sure. So I think light means activated. So like maybe the second, oops, the second, and then, what is that? Okay. Might not. No. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> I was just reading my own notes wrong. Five, not two. No. Well, what the heck? I do think the water is somewhat, you know, especially based on like the way this is set up, water is, you know, I'm wasting all this water because that, uh, that the uh, shape of the top of this building is for collecting rainwater. Anyway, um, okay, well maybe, oops. Let's try like two, three. Hmm. Let me see here. It's just a five. What does that mean? Oh. I think I get it. Oops. Not that. But just like trigger it and then close it. There we go. That kind of makes sense. Pretty short recording. Ah, now my turn. 
want to record something so always you will remember. What is uh, English for scramape? Scum from above. Your appearance should have inspired us to a better future. What does it mean for us as a people if we cannot embrace worlds outside our own? You were a, an angel from above. Always you will be my angel from above. who Anna is. I think this is Atrus's mom, his wife, or not. Hold on, wait a second. No. <laughs> Grandma. I'm all mixed up. Just... An angel. <laughs> you are angel. Right, right. Okay, yes. Anna is Scan's mom. Atrus's grandma. <laughs> The Dini Council knew it. They knew. If I hadn't tried to force my own ideals on your world, you would still be alive. You would still be alive. I wanted a... a life... full of magic. Full of books, the bridged worlds, that lit up the darkness like stars. Possibilities were endless. <sighs> it's just us now. You'll never have the life you should have had. Somehow, my love and compassion, it, it took that. I don't know how. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, one thing I, oh, ah, okay. One thing I was going to comment on is that the thing I've been thinking about for a while is that, um, the models are not bad, the, the character models. Um, they could be better, but they're about what I expected. Actually a little better than I expected. Um. Like, like they, they really do look decent. Um, like, hair is not as good, though. That's mostly where my complaint would be. But, um, I'm not disappointed with it at all. But, uh, 
the um, animation is pretty good, actually. Um, they've definitely used motion capture, and they've used motion capture for the lips and it sinking and everything, too. The problem is that with a lot of the um, the lines, they've used the old recordings, and um, so they're lip syncing to those recordings, and that actually hurts the quality of it quite a bit, I think. Uh, unless I'm mistaken, I'm pretty sure in most of these, you know, where they have an original recording, they're using the original recording. I think Atris was completely... I'd have to see Atris again, but I think they completely reperformed Atris because they always do that. <laughs> Every single time Rand redoes a Atris. Um, but... Yeah. I think if they... I honestly think they should have just gotten actors and re redone all of it. Um, I don't know. At the risk of disappointing some people. Um, however, because um, character models are my main complaint, um, I, I think, you know, like that's one of the easiest things to patch um, in future years if they wanted to, if they were, <laughs> heaven forbid, re-release this one more time. Um, they already have, like, a pretty good-looking world, which, you know, they could enhance just a little bit. They could probably use um, AI to assist them to an extent, and they could also just, you know, add some more polygons here or there. But, basically, um, Replacing, like, updating the character models would be an easy thing to do, really. Anyway. Um, I, I'm still impressed with what they did, you know, with the budget they have and the time they had. It's... Yeah, again, I don't know how much of it they were able to, like, use things from, you know, previous creation. I think they have, you know... I think to a, a pretty good extent they are able to reuse a lot of the assets that they probably still had from when they made, made Riven the first time. So that may be why they were able to produce so quickly. But anyway, um, there are a few more endings, and I was forgetting that... Um, Where was this? Right here. I was forgetting that there are multiple endings that have to do with opening up the fissure. And I do want to try to get as many of those as possible, despite the fact that we've already trapped Gan. We know when we're looking here, he is able to see us smile. Um, What is that? Is that... Is that Gant's face? Interesting. Um... Yeah, so... I think... First thing we'll do is we're just gonna open up the fissure. And then I'm going to try... Well, there's multiple things I can do, but... Actually, it might be faster to get the other thing I was wanting to do, which was to basically... Um, how long will it take me to go this way? I'm going to have to wait for this. Uh, 
that's actually let's do this first so um no important progress has been made so or like nothing irreversible has been done yet so um let's go ahead and use the book here gotta be some kind of stupid <laughs> You know, there is a non-zero possibility. I don't know exactly why you released me, but you realize, of course, that this must be the end for you. It may provide you with some solace, however, to know that with this act of self-sacrifice, you have secured your place in history. The Dani culture will be reborn, and the lives of millions will be purified. Yes, this is the original Thanks recording. The animation is good. It's just it's it's imprecise lip syncing, which I mean it's impossible unless it's tricky. So, and we will have to actually. I can just so I don't even need to stop the recording. I can just kill the game and then. Reboot. Achievements are a little messed up right now because I actually disconnected from the internet because I was having problems with the internet. Um. Maybe I'll fix that next time I reload. Yeah, but yeah, um, realistically speaking, there is a non-zero chance that the stranger will in fact do what they just did. Because, you know, people, who knows why people do the things they do. It's just what happens, <laughs> right? Um, but I am interested in seeing what will happen if I try to do this now while in Tay, which is not something I don't think I ever even tried when I played the game before. That's what I'm going to do. Um, I think the stranger... I, I know that canonically so so there's there's multiple canons right but I think was there any get like okay there's this exit this is where I need to go yes um There's the canon where whoever the stranger is is literally whoever the player is. Um, but there's also a canon where, and, and there's multiple versions of that canon too. But there's also the canon where the stranger is someone who found the book in by the cleft um, and adventure ensues. Um, wait, what am I doing? Am I? No, no, hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, hold on. Uh, I think... Okay. Yeah, I think I was supposed to go down. Oh, wait, no, this is just... This is just for the work. Uh, oh well. Okay, let's go back. Forgetting how to navigate. Okay, I think I do. I think I was supposed to go around 
uh, rotate the, uh... Okay, anyway. Focus, so... Stranger that came from the cleft. Um, I forget... It was New Mexico, I think. It might have been Arizona, but I think it was New Mexico. Is where it's supposed to be located. Um... Considering that this is late 19th century... Um, I think there's a really good probability that the stranger is indigenous. Um, yeah. So, if you had any question about their race, they're, they're like Native American, Native Mexican, something like that. just regular Mexican. Because I gotta think about this, like, actually there's probably a really good chance that they're Mexican. Because, you know, the Spanish invaded. I, I, I do, I'm pretty sure, like, by 1880-ish, you know, they're I, I guess it could go either way. Either they're indigenous North or Central American. Basically Central American. Um, or um, they're like, you know, the Spanish Mexican. I guess it's possible that they're like European too, but that's a low probability. Oh man, actually, I don't know, they totally could have been like an American immigrant in Mexico. But at the time, I think New Mexico was just Mexico. Because um, Mexico extended pretty far up in the, uh, yeah. is actually like one of my favorite ages even though there's not a whole lot to it like what we see oh I wonder 
I don't remember, like, what happens. I guess that's it. Then I just... The ability to go back. What, what even is this? Oh. Okay. I think this is somewhere else in Tay. I'd be a little disappointed if, to find out that it's not. And I'm just going back to Riven. Ah, I am. I could not tell what I was looking at there. All right, let's go back. I want to know what happens to... Actually, because of the fact that there's a link directly back to Riven immediately after that, I'm almost certain the cutscene's going to be the same. It's a nice view, though. I like the tree wasp house thing. This was box art, by the way. I forget exactly what box art, but it was box art. Um, we're not saving. Yeah, I really doubt this is going to be different, but... It appears that the Moyet oh. and I will finally be able to discuss our differences nice. face to face. I don't know exactly why you released me, but you realize, of course, that this must be the end for you. It may provide you with some solace, however, to know that with this act of self-sacrifice, you have secured your place in history. The Dani culture will be reborn and the lives of millions will be purified thanks to you farewell mm. yeah that did exist in the original game but I don't think I ever saw that ending Alrighty, let's kill it again, and I'll actually reconnect to the internet. Hopefully that won't um, cause any issues. Yeah, no issues at all now. Wait, no internet? Come on. There we go, now it's connected. Alright, um... I'm going to retry the sync. I'm not sure. Uh, oh. What? There's an update? Oh, shoot. I guess I'm going to have to update it first. <laughs> I'll end the recording here. Well, actually, the update's not taking that long. So I could just talk, you know? I don't know what I'd talk about, though. Oh, shoot. Now it's patching. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. It's patching the entire 20 gigs. I, I'm actually quite happy that this game has a small footprint. I don't really like it when... I mean, I know sometimes it's unavoidable, but I... I I, I like it when games don't take up a ton of space, <laughs> you know. Um, yeah. Hey, it's like we're still trapped in the book, huh? From your perspective, I can see my desktop and all, but you're in the dark because I have LBS set to just view Riven, and currently there is no Riven window, so it's in the dark. Nice being in the dark, isn't it? Alright. Well, as this is only uh, about 20% done patching, 
I, I think that um, I might as well pause the recording and we can resume later. Actually, I resumed the recording because we can listen to music. This is... Uh, this is actually Hamster Alliance music, which is royalty free. So, I mean, no harm there. I'll put him in the credits or, you know, in the description. He actually has made some pretty good stuff. He's been making music since like, like before the year 2000, like since the 90s. Which I guess is appropriate. So, um, this is Return of a Game from 1997. Let's listen to one of its 1997 tracks. This is called Wet Cat Freezer Burn 7.
Okay. okay. Yeah, so that was just... I, I wanted to let that finish. <laughs> Who knows if there's like an achievement for every way you can trap yourself. I don't think so. If there was, we failed to get those, probably. I'm not really sure. But anyway. Oh, there we go. Watch all the recordings. Finish reading every journal. Okay. Apparently no achievements for the other stuff I did. Or because no, I don't think so. Actually I don't I'm not sure. Oh hey I was wondering about this. So, it did in fact save my progress. You know, because I didn't create a new save. Okay. I'm tempted to actually find out if it'll give me achievement for doing it here, but... Let's, you know what we'll do is I'll just save the game here. I'll make this a permanent save of its own. And, um, and now I'll just return. So like we, c I can, I can try getting an achievement for it later. Oh, that looks different now. I see a sky, which is a little bit confusing. Would have thought... Maybe the update changed that. I don't know. Is it? Are we looking at that sky? I, I have no idea. Oh wait a minute. Was this there before? I'm not really sure. It probably was. I I don't know. I just didn't remember it. Okay. Um. One of the bad endings is inaccessible because we've already trapped again. But it's not going to stop me from going back for it. Um, but first. You know what? This is the weapon the Moiety have. Um, and I wonder what came first, you know? Like, was this also written in and then they made a weapon li like it? I think more likely they had the weapon and then this was created as a sign. It could be either way.
I wonder what they patched. You know? Like... The... it was... What size was the update? See, um, this... we see steam from here because we did redirect that pipe or whatever. So, I mean, this stuff is functional now. Okay, let's see. So there should be seven. Wait. What? Huh? Oh, that's seven. Right. Oh, that's one. Ah, oh, shoot. these like not in order oh I wonder if that's like to prevent you from solving it if you don't know how numbers work or no more specifically it's pre to prevent you from learning numbers from this device you know because if you could just like learn the sequence of this then you'd know how to count without having to like actually decipher it on your own and learn other methods you know by playing with the toy you know whatever oh shoot that was 10 okay Nine. Uh, it's, it's harder when they're not in order you know okay nine three oh wait ten nine eight Seven. That's what order then. Six. Where are we going to? Three. Okay, so they are in order. They're just backwards for some reason, which... I don't know, I mean... <laughs> oh, gosh. Yes, I am some kind of genius. Okay. No, hold on. It goes backwards. There we go. So this stick was that stick. stick is still broken here. Right. Um. Let's see. How does this work? What's this? Oh yeah, this is just a air pressure. I wonder what that even does. What that's for. Right. Oh, okay. Assuming that's a little too low. I'd expect it to actually make contact. But. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What? Okay. Seems to be. Um. Okay. Yeah, it just needs to be a little lower. I promise I just touched it. Okay, um... Uh, 
Ah, uh, we ripped it out this way. Nice.
should decipher that. Alrighty. We'll actually come from Temple Island. Um, on second thought, let's get one more bad ending first, um, before we get the proper ending. So I'll go ahead and save this. And, yeah, we'll keep that. But, uh, so yeah, so now I'm going to – I guess – so this is 24, 26. Um, how much do I need to do? There are actually – I think there are two bad endings, actually. No, 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 no. There's only one other way, because we can't free Catherine and not trap Gan. It's not possible. So the only bad ending we're going to get is going to be um, – oh, wait. No, no, no. Hold on. Yeah. Correct. Correct. All right, well, let's see if we can actually go straight over to – so the one thing I'm unsure about is I think that it used to be the combination for um, controlling that device was randomly generated and only generated once you get the combination. However, that might not be the case in this one. So we could just try and go and see if it works. But um, all right, um, I actually paused for a little bit, but I didn't tell you that I was pausing. <clears throat> But now I just told you. Only reason I did so was because I didn't, uh, because of how I reconnected, and I knew that you would see that little bit of stutter there, and I, I didn't want you to think that that was my computer that was stuttering. Not that it hasn't already done that many times, but you know, like I just, I, I wanted to make sure you knew that that one wasn't. <laughs> it was the recording. Having ended and then me uh, reconnecting to the game because I, it was, well not exactly minimized, but you get the point. So yeah, I, I think this may have actually been there in the original game, I just don't know. Wait a sec. Is this some meat? I don't know what that is. It may just be a rock. Um. Yeah, I don't know what this is. It kind of reminds me, sort of, of the, uh, devices in abduction that you are not supposed to get too close to. I'll try the combination. It'll be interesting to see if it works or not. If it doesn't work, then know that it's not assigned until it's 
been obtained. It's like the engineering was probably good, but and maybe I don't know. Maybe it is safer than I realize. Aside from the fact that the island is falling apart and things are drifting, that that part makes it more dangerous for sure. So, let's say, seven, one, seven, four, ten, nine, two, uh, three. Okay. Who knows if it even gets randomized, you know? No idea. Um, yeah. So... Did I skip part of the cutscene, or...? That's different. What if...? It's like not an official ending. Where it is. 
Okay, what? That is not what I expected. Hold on. <laughs> what? Well, that's cool, because it was unexpected. I... Hmm. I wonder if that's what happens if you cheat, sort of. I mean, it's not really cheating. Because you did obviously get the code and then you just went back to a previous save. But maybe, like, it's cheating if you just, like, brute force the whole thing. And so... I, I almost want to try it again, thinking, like, maybe... No, no, that... That's not. I definitely didn't just like skip a cutscene or something. That was okay. Yeah. So I wonder. Maybe because it was done earlier. Like if you just blind luck open it up, then that happens because you shouldn't get the satisfaction of the other ending. And also it would be confusing because. You haven't even met Gan yet. You know, like... Or maybe I had. I don't remember where we were at this part. I think I may have, actually. I, I'm not sure. No, I hadn't. Right? I don't, I don't remember, actually. The point is... Um... It, like, depends on how much progress you've made in the game. It's not just about what state everything else is in. Um, yeah, it's interesting. Very satisfying, too. Okay. Wow. I didn't know getting all the endings would be this much work. I think I'm also going to try... You know what? Um, let me see if it's possible to... Um, I can't navigate out. I have to... I have to rotate the dome. This is different. Like, the, the layout is different than the original game. But... this like three times. I'm just gonna go directly to Catherine's and release her using the code that I'm not actually supposed to have. You know, Gan is entrapped. Absolutely absurd.
This is like the only one that was like already. You know, I could actually choose to track it. No one's stopping me from doing that. Of course, I'll never be able to get back, so it's not like I can actually block myself off from this island. Anyway. Yeah, they're all lit up. I think this save was after visiting Gan. for finding my way to Tay. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna try so many things to try. See, this would be, well, it's not even, I actually don't know what the point is of doing this, but, because I could just, like, rescue her without even coming to talk to her, but, yeah, we'll see, I don't know, this is just how I'm choosing to do it, it's fine. Still startles me even a little bit. You made it. But how did you get past Gen? I know what he's doing. He's watching you. He's waiting for you to make a mistake. You can't let Gen get back to Dunny. Find the Moiti. They have the book. Be careful. Yeah, um, I don't even care about... Hey, wait a minute. I didn't try this before. Just coming back. Wait a minute. Oh, I could be a total creep. Alright, well. Actually, we should have been able to see her through that crack, because we know she just paces back and forth all the time.
be. Oh yeah, that's that. Okay. Oh, I like this a little bit. I didn't notice that before. That this whole thing is on a bit of a slant. So, yeah, nice. I was kind of surprised I didn't notice that before. Okay. Set. Uh, maybe it doesn't work. Okay. Sure, sure uh, simplifies things a lot to not let me solve this before I'm ready to. Because, man, unless I'm not even using the right combination. But I don't think I... Yeah, I don't think I'm allowed to. Um, which, I mean... Can you really blame them? This, this keeps things much simpler. Because... Um, yeah. Okay. I guess so I'm not sure what I have to do for the other ending. Okay. But I do know so I one thing I haven't done is trapping myself after um releasing Catherine, which we will do. Um Yeah, uh I'm just going to go to It doesn't matter if I've visited the prison island or not. I'm just going to go straight to Tay. And then Honestly, not even sure if I visited No, I must have, because oh, I really don't know. Nah, you know what? I think I did. if there is some kind of zip mode. I don't think so. I um I actually have a thought that I might want to speed run this. I guess maybe a little silly, but you can speed run anything pretty much. Why not speed run this? <laughs> I'm not supposed to know this, right? Or am I? No, maybe I am. I don't know if I did it yet or not. But... Oh yeah, I've clearly been here. Okay. Yeah, that's right. I just hadn't ever solved this, which we will do now. Um, I, I wonder if this is actually the moth and not a leaf cutter, as I've said. All right, uh, let's see. Sunners first. Where are they? Then the 
froggy. Not that froggy. But, um... This froggy. And then... have to do them in order. It really does matter. And then the work. It's amazing. It's like just for dramatic effect. We shine light on it. I think that's because it that was kind of how the original game was, you know? It's kind of an interesting control. Time to lose. Come dart me, guys. Patty cake, patty cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Cut it and pull it and mark it with the. escaped as that. I I like the stuff where the game doesn't force you to look, you know. If you miss something it's fine. Hey, they didn't give me any food. What's that? It's just like saying time has passed, I, I guess. I don't know. Katarina, now the Sayaya Palo. Lip-syncing is not that bad, you know. Now, Katarina, ne. We see for polo, ya sepe yai. Oh. oh, 
Oh, interesting. So, if you don't know, in the original game, uh, you would have to read the material, and then they would come back with a linking book back, instead of you having all of this that you're able to walk through to another linking book. Yeah. There we go. You satisfied now? Nothing to see. Alright. Now, how about I stay up here, you get in the lift, and I will lower you down, and then I'll just stand there. Um, I guess in order to do the thing, I would have to wear your outfit. And I don't have your outfit, so. I wonder if Desai just means read. I don't know. Um, so I still don't know if we've actually talked to Gan yet. I really don't know, like, where we're at with all this. I guess it wouldn't hurt just to... Let's see. So now we have the book. Let's just let's just go visit Gan for good measure. I guess. this section or not. We'll see. Because this really is a lot of... time though. How about 
we just get straight to the point. So, look, I'm showing the game that I do have the ability to see this. Alright, the combination is the same. I'm gonna guess that this isn't randomized. Alright. I should save first. You know, before I go all the way that that is. <laughs> I should have just kept going that way. Would not have lost my. Oh, what am I doing? Haha. <laughs> So many saves. I hope I don't get too confused, you know. Um, save on top of this one, I guess. Yeah, I don't even know if I. So this is for later for achievements, which is probably not going to make a difference. Um. This is like the ending of the game as well. And I think, I don't remember what this was. Anyway. Try to go down. No, can't. Okay. doing but thank you 
I finally am free. Admittedly, maybe one of the impressive things about Riven was just how many endings it had. All the ways you can, like, you know, that they crafted an ending for all the different ways you could mess things up. That ending that I just got is probably one of the most common bad endings. Because it's very easy for the player to not understand what they're doing, but they're just like, oh, I have this combination, it's a good thing, and they're just not really thinking. But, or, or they are, they just, you know, they're stuck, they don't know what to do, and so they just, like, let's just do this. But yeah, that... that last one where I just fall straight into the fissure, no dialogue. That's got to be one of the more rare ones. You know, doing it before we even have the combination, that is... Again, like I said, I don't even... I actually don't think that existed in the original game. Um, okay, so... Both of these are after freeing Gan. I mean, not freeing Gan. <laughs> we will be doing that. But um, I think what we want to do now is just go about it as if we're completing the game. Um, what is the route I want to take here? So let's go free Catherine by going into what is what is that? Sam, hold on. Is it like is it the camera? Hmm. See, Gan is currently trapped, and that camera is no longer following me, so I wonder if there's some continuity with that. Although, see, I know it used to follow me here. Yeah, it no longer follows me. That is 100% that is because Gan is... So, I, I'm a little puzzled. Like... I don't think Gan is able to watch us from 233. So I don't know if, like, someone else is watching for him, or, you know, he's just running around as much as I am to not be. Whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa. This wasn't where I wanted to go. These aren't what we call plot holes, they're just. Um. What would be the word? They are... Curiosities, at least. But they're more like... They're more like problems, but they're, they're not... They're also not impossibilities. It's like... It's just like... A little bit of a stretch that we just kind of... Are fine with ignoring.
said there was a decent amount of content still ahead, this is what I was talking about. Because I knew I wanted to go through, like, finding all these endings. Um, I think that's not what I want. Okay. This one. We want this one. Not quite taking the shortest possible path, but that's okay. that there's a decent amount of freedom with a lot of this. If we were playing this game seriously, we would seriously have been hitting our head against the wall many, many times before just stumbling on the right way <laughs> to do things. You made it. But time is running out. You have to get me out of here. The combination to the elevator is somewhere in Gen's outpost in yeah, H233. Go quickly. And be careful. Yeah, I have gotten that dialogue before in the original game. But hard to remember all those little details. There used to be a much shorter path, you know, to, uh, to go up there and talk to her. I just don't uh, remember exactly what the layout was. She said go quickly, but we can just take our time. Hopefully I actually do have the combination correct. Okay. Alright, 
what does this button do? That might be the reset button, and this is like... So useful. Can I flip this, or is it locked again? I have locked it. What? What does this button do? Uh, does it just lock it after the fact? I don't know. I don't know. people may already know what's happening. Once we're back with the Moiti, we'll have time to regroup. Can I see the book? You did it. Okay. Captured again. Yeah, we're they... Free. They're somehow able to tell by reading the text. But they're still his followers. I'm not sure what they'll do once they realize he's gone. I have to get the villagers to safety as soon as possible. And you... You go back to where you first arrived and reopen the fissure. I know it's risky, but it's the only way to signal Atrus. I'll try to make it back there as soon as possible, but don't wait for me. Oh, and don't forget the combination in my journal. You'll need it. Was some of that dialogue new? I'm actually, no. Seems like there was more exposition than I remember. Better explanation of what we're supposed to do and why, kind of. I guess I should just have paid attention to if the... Yeah. I forget, I don't think we were able to wander around here before. It's unfortunately not too much to see, but... Get a new view. Oh, it's a call button. I don't remember how the how it worked in the first game. I think what happened before is that she actually gets in the elevator with you. You descend, and then she runs ahead of you. But the layout is totally different, and obviously they wanted us to explore. The logistics are just different, not being pre-rendered, so this, this way works just fine. And there's a logical reason for why it's spinning.
question. Do I actually want to go back to Temple Island because it was obnoxiously... I think what I'd rather do is go to... So instead of going there, let's go here. Because it really takes time to go through the gate room. being faster, but... Uh, uh. I don't think we've ever gone up through this one. Well, we did when we first visited it. we didn't even have to call the elevator. So. We should be able to beat how long it takes the gate room, but I don't know. not sure this route was faster. It might have been faster to go the other way. Because you have so much here. Yeah, the other route is actually more direct. Whoops. Where is it? Wait a minute. No. I went the right way. I forget how things have changed. to call it. Alright, I hit that pretty quickly. I kind of think this is slower. But whatever, I'm tighter of the gate room. This is not a let's play, by the way. It is, by definition, not a let's play. faster. No doubt about it. You still have to go through here. Alright. 
Speaking of being tired of the gate room, I actually want to see if there's any indication in these about what that thing is by the cut down forest. In the cut down forest. Wait, hold on. Wait. Yeah. I don't think we do have any clues about it. Nothing. Did I look at this one? No. Okay, well, whatever. It'll remain a mystery. Well, let's see if we remember combination without having to look it up. No, I don't. I mean, I, I could get it if I fumbled around with it a bit, but uh, no, I'm not doing that. skip something. Something's... Six. Nine, ten. Hold on. So this is supposed to be a three. Oh, I see. Okay. I'm not tired of doing this. I might be. I might be a little bit. Hey, you know what? Well, we already know that. Yeah. Because we know that the correct way to do things is to pull it up rather than to push it down. Villagers are safely in the Rebel Age. I thank you. As do I. You've accomplished more than I could have hoped for. You've given me back my life. The path home is now clear for all of us. Oh. 
hold on, make sure you have the right book. This is where our paths must part. Perhaps we'll meet again someday. Yeah, I guess all Atrus's recordings are original. that acts as both a wall and a bridge. And, though I'm unable to understand how, the very flow of stars that brought my mist book into worthy hands, I am sure served as a safe passage home for my friend. The age of Riven has come to a close, but the people of Riven are free. And now I am at rest, understanding that in books, and ages, and life, the ending can never truly be written.
didn't want the thing to end just right there. So I have a few things I want to say about. Um, you know, I talked about how a lot of things make more sense in um, the the new version. I didn't really explain why. Um, so there's a bunch of things to to talk about. Um, first, if we want to say much about um, the entrance to the 233rd age, um, it's it does feel a little more logical um, just because of the way the puzzles are put together. Um, it being all in one centralized location makes more sense. Um, as far as security is concerned, though. I think, um, I think that they're pretty much equal, the old version and the new. Um, the problem with the old version is that the slider, um, is in, um, it's in all five domes and can be brute forced. And so then it's just a matter of waiting for them to be activated from the central hub. So that is a problem. Um, so I think I would say that the new version is slightly more secure. Um, uh, they, they're both flawed, though. I think both the Moiety and Gan have bad security systems. And it's interesting to see um, both when we're on the 233rd age and we see Gan making progress with uh, understanding the moieties totems and also with um, just just seeing that he's been writing more books and he's on his he's you know he's making progress at least um, the the moiety we see a lot more of them making progress against gan as well you know without our interruption if we never arrived we would see I mean, we're not certain, but it almost seems as though the moiety do have the upper hand because they do understand how to get around the things Gan has. There's no way that they don't have access to his workshop and therefore would be able to pretty quickly um, get access to the 233rd age. In fact, they may already have access to it, probably do, um, but it just haven't taken advantage of that because that's not their interest at the moment. Um, but of course they could certainly be planning uh, an attack of some kind. Um, so there's that. Um, I, one thing that I, I didn't talk much about, I said that I liked the new intro better. When I said that I wasn't referring to the entire intro, I meant the, um, just the linking in to Riven. I thought that the way it was shorter... Um, and just graphically, I just liked it better. Um, but that's a very, that's the very artistic and subjective, uh, thing. Um, there is a, there's a bit of a weirdness though with, um, the fact that Atris leaves uh, Dunny and goes to Mist and even locks the book behind him. Um, I think that that is much more confusing than in the original version and is in fact much worse. Um, I don't think that, um, yeah, I, I mean, I would personally, I would go back and I would actually reshoot that part and actually change it. Um, However, um, talking to the community on Discord, I think that um, it can make sense. Um, the best theory being that um, Gan needed to go to Rhyme because um, that would allow him to use the Crystal Viewer and to watch you as you arrive in Riven. And having that means that... Um, you know, he, he could tell at least enough from the fuzzy image on the panel that, um, 
you know, there is a bit of a cage or of some sorts. You know, we know that Cho guards it. So he needed to know what the outcome was. If, it, if, the, if the situation was bad, if you, you were killed or something, then he would need to change his plans, right? So he had to be able to see what was happening. Um, it makes a lot of sense. Now, locking the mist book behind him, um, well, for one thing that does help prevent if, I mean, Gans or anyone else is not going to be able to come back to Dunny. Um, you know, because the prison book is a prison book. Um, but um, you being prevented from using it, aside from just being gameplay, again, this is gameplay because we do know that, like, you couldn't, um, we don't want, it was easier for them to not have a continuous uh, animation because that's not how they made the game. And so they would have to have a way to, like, create something that loops and it wouldn't have been as it would i'm not saying it can't have been done but it would have been less convenient it was actually easier for them to just have atris link away now we don't want the player to follow we want the player to continue forward and so that's why it's locked but in universe i really think that we think that it's perfectly reasonable to um, lock it away just to prevent you from changing your mind or you know following him and you know it's just admittedly maybe in this version atris does seem a bit like a coward but i do think that there's a bit of um really just for your own good or rather for atris's um mindset or whatever it's fine to step away long enough uh, from the writing. I, we know from the journals that it's still really important to the monitor. He needs to know when you're going to signal. I don't think he left for a, a very long time, just long enough to know that your arrival was relatively safe. So, um, only a couple other th comments. Um, the entrance to the moiety, I like that there's an alternate way into the caves that makes much more sense than it only being from that one prison because this way the prison is more like an extra entrance um there's um i riv the uh the i the village or jungle island is the village is very well locked down this time which is kind of why we don't see as many Rivenies as we run into them. Um, I think there's a lot more hint towards them already being in the process of um, migrating much of them over into Tay, and so that's why we don't don't see a lot um, in this particular version. Um, I I know that that also just means it's easier, to, so they don't have to do as many animations and stuff, but. Um, from that standpoint. Now, I really like that, I think I said this already, but I like that the fire marbles have more lore behind them and more purpose. Um, so overall, the way that you enter the 233rd age, it actually makes more sense. Um, and I kind of already talked about that while playing. Um, I, 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 think that overall um there's a couple well one other thing is um the slider puzzle not not the not the five lever sliders but the the uh grid um map on uh on survey island the slider puzzle there is a little strange because it's almost just like a little mini game that exists just to exist. There's no reason why Gan would use that. Um, there's, it's not particularly hard to get down to the workroom, and that's fine. Um, it's just weird that it's like a puzzle now, you know. Whereas before, it was just turn the maglev around. Um, I, I do think it makes a lot more sense. We see a lot more of the Rivenies locking themselves away 
and Gan locking all of his stuff away. We see a lot more of things being isolated, um, you know, even with, um, I don't know, even with um, just like the access to the Temple Island, I guess, and just in general, there's just a different sort of vibe about it. Um, I think, I think that this version, overall the gameplay is better for the average player, and it's going to be, people are going to have different opinions about what gameplay they like better. I think the world is a little better in the original as far as just how, how believable the puzzles are, um, but I do think that the the new um, Moiti puzzles were more fun to play, and that, that is actually important. Um, there's a lot of extra lore, but um, overall, the in interesting feeling I get with this version is almost as if this was the version of Riven that is more true to the canon that exists in the minds of the original creators, or at least in Robin and Rand's minds. Um, and maybe, maybe Richard's as well. Um, or, sorry. Yeah, you know what I mean. Um, anyway, um, I think, you know, as we're saying that there's infinite truths. And I think there are many versions of Riven and Mist that can exist as we've already seen with Mist. And I think that these are just different versions and whichever version is more true to you is fine. That's what's more correct to you. Um, I think to me somehow this new version of Riven feels more like the true version of Riven. And, I'll, and I think that and for better or for worse this version of Riven is going to last for a longer period of time throughout history because um, we had a version in 1997, 27 years later is a remake that's in 3D, um, and that's going to be the version that going forward, if many more people do play, this is the version of Riven they're going to know. And any future remasterings or um, whatever that are created for Riven are going to be based on this new version, I think. Um, and so, yeah, whether you like it or not, this is actually like the correct Riven now. And perhaps the same could be said of the old version of Mist. Um, maybe you don't like that take, but that's, that's what I'm seeing. Um, I don't think there's much more to say. I, um, I think personally, I, I like the original version better, but I do think that this version is, is actually more accurate, if that makes any sense.